In this video, I'm going to show you two simple tricks on how you can improve the sound pressure level on a facade from traffic noise when you have a case like this. Here we have the facade and we have some balconies. Now, if you have sound coming from the street, let's, let's do some. We take the magic RGB pencil here. This is the sound. It'll come up like this and it will, bam, be reflected there and it'll hit the window and it it will also be able to go and, and hit the window from here so you get like your direct sound and you get this one so one way to reduce this is to mount like in this case it's uh, what's it called? Recke. The, the guardrails here if you make them uh, airtight it could be like a glass or something then it, this magic sound will actually It'll bounce off, but it will. This one will still hit the the surface, and if it comes here, it can come into the apartment. So the ne next thing you could do then, perhaps, what if we put some sound absorbing material here below the balconies? Well, then the reflex is gone too, and now you'll mostly have the ones that are in the, the free line of sight because if you can see the sound source you can hear it too but the, with this little trick we remove we remove we, we give it some shielding here so you get like an acoustic shade with the guardrail here and you can add absorption on the lower part of the upper balcony and then it won't be able to it'll, it'll stop there instead of bouncing on so, two simple tricks. And in today's video, I'm wearing a knit tie and a green little pocket square, which is a pretty nice one. When, when you pair it with a vest, the cool thing is that if you just get rid of the jacket and, and you still look really dapper and it'll, it'll keep you warm as well. This jacket is actually very good in the winter because it's lined it's a pretty thick wool and it'll keep you warm. I really like it. See ya.